this turbine is uh, 2 kilowatts to 5 kilowatts. The turbine capacity is uh, from 2 kilowatts to 5 kilowatts. This is the alternator. The alternator is 2 kilowatts and uh, we are uh, keeping a stand. On the stand we are fixing both the things, the turbine and the alternator. The turbine is rotated by the pressure of water. The RPM of this turbine is 1500 RPM. Plus excess loss is 100, so 1600 RPM this turbine will rotate. This will be coupled directly to the alternator. The alternator is 2 kilowatts. It is having the capacity to generate 2 kilowatts or 2000 watts. The alternator and the turbine shaft is coupled and the water is poured inside this particular tank. This tank is totally covered from all the sides and a pump is installed inside this. So the pump is pumping water into the turbine at the rate of 5 liters per second with 30 meter head. So the alternator is rotated by this particular turbine for 1600 times a minute thereby generating 2000 watts. This 2000 watts is 220 volt and uh, this is having 10 amps. The pump is consuming 1.6 amps. The pump is pumping 5 liters per second with a head of 30 meters of height and the pump is 3 phase, 440 volt, 1.6 amps. So this pump is continuously pumping water on critical continuous duty onto the turbine blades. The turbine is rotated coupled to the alternator. The turbine is rotating at 1600 RPM. Thereby 2000 watts is generated every hour. In this way, the turbine is a new system. It's a specially designed for impinge and reaction methods both used and designed in a one platform. This can be used for fall as well as flow and we are concentrating mostly on flow based generation and flow based systems because the flow based mechanism is very comfortable. It can be available anywhere locally made. This is called still water electricity. The same water is rotated again and again thereby the power generation is normal. I mean to say it is continuous in operation and uh, 24 into 7 you get absolutely with the same voltage amps will be same no fluctuation in voltage because the water pressure is constant water flow is constant water velocity is constant thereby the turbine rotates in a constant speed and the alternator rotates at a constant speed thereby we will be getting a constant ampere output and the voltage of this particular system is also constant thereby no fluctuations in the voltage. This is the main part we are designing and for the past 20 years we are into green power generation uh, technologies. Our research is based only on the flow based mechanism. We are concentrating only on the flow, water flow. So this is the technology on total. Thank you.